Hey, everybody. <laughs> it's Charlie. What is up? This is Vision Board Course with Charlie. This is just a quick rundown and also to see how are you doing? This is officially week one. Congratulations, everyone. You made to week one. You should have read chapters one and chapter two. And by read, I mean, you could also audio list, listen to it by audio book because I did a reading of it for you. And tell me how that went. I'm just call, I'm just doing this real quick before I go to bed because I want to know where you are. I know most of us are introverts. It's only by the Lord's miraculous power how he got us together. <laughs> how do you unite introverts? But um, some of us have not regenerated to the point of just using our minds to communicate. So we have to use our words, starting with me first. So I'm here to ask you, how is it going? Are you able to read any of the chapters of the two chapters for the first week for the vision board course? And um, what I can do to help to make this a fun journey for all of us, this isn't supposed to be like another chore, which I mean, it is a task and it's for our destinies and the destinies of those connected to us but it's fun. We're literally designing the life that God wants us to live. So anyway, I'm not going to be on here long. I'm going to do a quick rundown just in case, just to have some visuals here to communicate further of what I was trying to communicate in our um, respective spaces. So first of all, if you have any questions, you know, you can always reach out to me, charlie at pillarsandfriends.com. Okay. Charlie at pillarsandfriends.com. I think everyone has their um, login information and your that means you have access to all your course materials um, at terrycourses.com. Terrycourses.com is where you have everything. And congratulations, you have it for life. Everything you have is for life. So... These things are, this is a proven system. Obviously, the author didn't just come up with an idea. She started reaping results. And so she wanted to give her gift, share her gift with the world around her. And these are proven results, not only for her, but guess what? I've used them as well. So you'll see that in the coming days um, in our respective spaces, I'll be able to show you pictures of what God has show me how to use uh, to, to acquire and um, to have using this system. And it's not just about getting a fancy new car and all that, although I did get that. Um, it's, it's about doing and having everything that the Lord wants you to have by knowing the various rules of engagement in this life. And you learn faster by those who have done it, done it rightly and done it successfully. And so that's what we are learning from Minister Terry Savelle Foy. Go to, if you go to terrycourses.com, I'm going to show you real quick here uh, a rundown. Sorry, this is my favorite song. I didn't realize it was on repeat. Oh, my goodness. I love this song by Jonathan Nelson. Let me turn that down. Okay, so... Um, First of all, let's go ahead and look. Oh, I want us to um, look at the screen here. All of us are in the prayer group, so I don't mind um, telling you this. Today, it, uh, well, today is still Wednesday here, but for you guys, it's Thursday. So this is our first big testimony day. So we're going to be doing that at 5 p.m. Watt, which will be 12 p.m. my time. Like I said, it's like nighttime here, 10.52 p.m. in Atlanta. I'm going to bed. <laughs> but tomorrow, it'll be 12 in the afternoon when this happens. 5 p.m. Watt is West African time. I just use West African time because most of us met on West African time. So it's just <laughs> something that um, it's easy. So we're going to have a testimony day, which includes celebration of our March birthdays. And March birthdays are um, Sister Jacqueline Lee and Sister Marsha Narti. I wonder if she's named 
from the month of March, Marcia. Moving right along, I want to go right on through these real quick. This is our calendar for the month of March. I hope you can see that okay. Um, this is our KGPF calendar. I said I would not be mixing KGPF that much. Um, but since all of us in the, in the vision board course right now are from KGPF, I'm just going to show you these things real quick. Um, I hope you can see it. So today is what? Wednesday. Tomorrow is Thursday, the 23rd. As you can see, that's Marsha Nardi's birthday there. Jacqueline's up here. And um, okay, so if you can kind of see here on Saturday, the 25th will be our first Vision Board course video lecture. It'll be from about 2.30 p.m. to 3.30 p.m. what? Okay, so this is our, our schedule for, for VBC is this Monday. These are the days you need to remember. Monday, Wednesday, Saturday. Okay, you got that? I showed this on our YouTube page under the community board. I hope you can see this okay. Um, Monday, we read the first chapter. Wednesday, we read the second chapter. Saturday, we come together for the video lecture by Minister Terry Savelle Foy. Okay, so every week is two chapters. Do the e-workbook after you read the second chapter. I'm sorry, that was a mistake there. Do the e-workbook after you read the second chapter between Wednesday and Saturday. Then on Saturday is the actual video lecture. While I'm here, who said start writing covenant daily tasks? <laughs> we don't have that in this week and week one, but in week two, you'll see that our assignment is to write out our daily task. In week one, we are to put out 101 of our yearly goals. So, but those of us who started with us at the in the first launch have already done this part. And some of you already have your vision boards. That's perfect. This would be a great time to review that to see if you're actually keeping up with it. But for those of you who are brand new, week one is getting everything out your system. Don't worry about how big or small it is. Don't worry about if you have the money for it. You get everything out. Right, 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 right. 101 things. And from there, we narrow it down to 10 things, 10 goals for the year. Okay, from the 10 goals from the year, we narrow it down to daily tasks. What daily tasks can you keep up with and look at with on a monthly basis to see how close am I or how far am I from acquiring this monthly goal that will get me to my top 10 yearly goals? So I told you, AJS, Apostle Selman would be teaching us more about dreams and visions in 2023, when did he say this? Last Sunday for the rewarding, let's see, <laughs> what was it called? The reward system of the kingdom, Sunday, March 19th. These are all the quotes he made during that service, by the way. Let those who have results speak to you. The Have the grace for a nonstop continual development. So let those who have results speak to you. Terry Zavella Foy has results. She's been using this for two over two decades. I know she looks, she's uh, very youthful looking and has a youthful voice, but she is uh, very um, wise in the spirit and mature and skillful in, um, in, in what she does here as a coach in teaching these things. Like I said, I have created vision boards using her system. She was the first person who taught me how to do it. And I have also reaped results, but I have not mastered the results. Therefore, I'm always learning. And I'm so grateful that you're here learning with me. This is Apostle Selman's leadership principle, Genesis 17, 6. I call him the rainmaker <laughs> because he says he has the kingmaker anointing. 
And obviously he also carries the mantle of Elijah. So um, I call him, I say he has the rainmaker anointing. It's raining kings and queens, and we are part of that. Hallelujah. So that's what that's about. Now, moving right on, right along. Okay, so when you go to terrycourses.com, this is what you will see. This is the actual um, course. It's a six-week course. It's a six-week course. Once you read chapters one and chapter two, we come together on Saturday to do the video lecture. This is what it'll look like. You log in and this is the vision board course, okay? So each week, like I said, is two chapters, excuse me, each week is two chapters and um, the video lecture, two chapters in the video lecture. So let's go here. Let's go ahead and look at that. This is the assignment guide first. So we are now in week one. Week one, creating the vision. This is where we are. Brand new week starting out. We read two chapters of Dream It, Pen It, Live It book. Do week one, which covers both chapters. Then we watch the video lex lesson or video lecture, which for us is on Saturday. Okay. Trying to get to the actual book. <laughs> there it is. So this is the actual Dream It, Pen It, Live It book. Since we're globally learning, um, we don't have time to wait on physical materials. So this is a beautiful alternative to have an ebook. And again, all these materials are yours for life. And because it is um, at no expense to you and um, uh, uh, online so easily accessible, please, please don't take it for granted. Please, please. Do not take it for granted. Um, this is a literal course. It's not just something fun to do. It is It is fun, but it's regarding our, our destiny. So we want to take it serious, right? So we're going to scroll all the way down to the contents. So for week one, this is what we're doing right now. We read the introduction, tra chapter one, and chapter two. Because remember, every week we do how many chapters? We read two chapters and one video. So for week one, it'd be chapter one and chapter two. For week two, it'd be chapter three and chapter four. Week three, it'll be chapter five and chapter six until we go all the way down to chapter 12. That makes it a six week course. And we will have a, um, we will have a, a, a graduation time. <laughs> I think that would be fitting. So that's the actual book. You read two chapters per week. After we read the second chapter, after we read the second chapter, that's when we do the workbook, e-workbook of Dream It, Pen It, Live It. Because each week is it covers both chapters. So of course the introduction and then week one, creating the vision, welcome and discussion of chapters one and two. So it each week covers both chapters in the E work book, work book. That's the difference. So the workbook is, um, that's the introduction. It helps us to remember the things that we read about, or in your case, listen to through the audio book. Because a lot of times we hear things, but we don't really hear it here, or we might miss some things. Like Apostle says, Romans 10, 17, faith comes by hearing and hearing. Faith is obedient action. So we can't take action on what we don't really know or understand. That's why we have this workbook to help us remember and solidify the things that we read because the first hearing is for awareness. The second hearing is for understanding. Well, if you don't hear it twice by doing this workbook that's in the course, it helps us to 
remember it that way. So this first week is 19 pages. So as you can see here, that includes the introduction. So it doesn't really line up, but you can look up at the top right hand corner and see, oh, that's for still week one. That's how you know. And so we there will be like many lessons, small lessons. And then once you get to the very last page of each week of the workbook, there will be an action step. So there are all these small lessons that you do to complete to help you remember the two chapters read prior in the week. Then the big thing is the action step, which in week one this week is to make a list of those 101 things. And then uh, remember the importance of writing it down, writing it down. Remember Apostle in that picture I showed you from our community posts on YouTube, he says, start writing covenant daily tasks. Well, we do the daily tasks in week two, okay? So that is all. I just wanted to do a quick rundown there to show you how it works um, in general. Again, if you have any questions, you can reach out to me at the email. It's through terrycourses.com. I love you and I'll see you later today. Most likely for you, you guys, it's going to be later today, Thursday, March 23rd to celebrate Testimony Day and birthdays. By the way, today, Thursday, March 23rd, is Sister Marcia's birthday. So give her a big happy birthday and floor some kisses and say happy belated birthday to our dear sister Jacqueline. I love you all. See you later. Bye-bye.